important that I start off my tenure as county executive on a high spiritual note. Um, the reason I am here as county executive is because Hashem has given me the strength uh, to do this and to be successful, and has given me great supporters and friends like our chairman of the party, Joe Cairo, who is a great friend of the Jewish people. And uh, I'd just like to introduce um, a couple of our elected officials that are here representing the Five Towns area. My good friend Howard Coppell from Lawrence. Howard, thank you so much for being here. We also have the president of our school board in Lawrence, Murray Foreman. Nice to see you, Murray. Thank you so much. And uh, obviously my wife, Segal, is here. And uh, we have our newest member of the legislature, Mazi Pillip. Mazi um, is uh, someone who was born in Ethiopia and um, she was saved by Israel in the United States on Operation Solomon. Uh, she was brought to Israel. She was raised in Israel. She had never been on an airplane before and she landed in Israel and she saw a paratrooper and she said, someday I'm going to do that. So she became an Israeli para, uh, paratrooper. And then um, she met a great guy who was a Russian emigre in Israel. And they decided to move their family here to the United States, where her husband practices medicine here on Long Island. And she's the newest member of our legislature. So uh, let's give her a round of applause. And again, um, thank you for all for being here. Uh, this is truly a blessing and uh, means a lot to me. So with that, uh, Rabbi Benjamin Kamenetsky of blessed memory uh, was my dear friend. He was actually um, a pioneer in the Orthodox community here on Long Island. And um, he passed a few years ago. Uh, I actually was with him uh, two days before he passed at his nursing home. I went to see him. And for those of you who didn't know him, he was a political junkie, loved politics. <laughs> and uh, he was always involved in, in all kinds of politics, both sides, Republican and Democrat, but mostly Republican. <laughs> uh, and uh, it was funny because I came up to see him and he was sleeping in his, uh, in his bed at the nursing home. And the nurse said, I'm gonna wake him up. And I said, no, please don't wake him up. Uh, he looks like he's, you know, he's resting peacefully. She goes, no, he would love to have the company. He's been sleeping all day. I'm gonna wake him up. So she wakes him up and he looks at me and he goes, what's going on politically? <laughs> so he truly was a political junkie, but um, the, uh, the legacy is there. The apple doesn't fall far from the tree. And uh, over the years, Rabbi Mordecai Kamenetsky and I have become dear friends. Um, I have so many rabbis here, but I have Rabbi Yamin Levy, who is not only a dear family friend, but he married me and Segal from the Iranian Jewish Center in Kings Point. So uh, there's a lot here. I could mention everybody. Rabbi Pearl, obviously, Rabbi Friedman, uh, Rabbi Waller. All right, I'm gonna stop now because I'll, <laughs> I'll forget somebody. But uh, again, thank you so much. And I'm gonna turn it over to okay. Rabbi Kamenetsky. Listen, we'll be brief. I've been, as Bruce mentioned, since the 1950s, uh, since Holly Patterson and Queso and uh, all, you know, I can't even name uh, name all of the Eugene Nickerson that's on the D side, you know. So I was in this office quite a number of times, but I never had the opportunity to go like this and kiss a mezuzah. You know, this is a historic first. Uh, putting a mezuzah in the Nassau County uh, Executive's office, and the fact that the county executive, who is going to interact with people of all faiths and all religions and all colors and creeds. Each one who walks through this door to get business done in Nassau County will see a testimony that the county executive says, there is somebody, a greater power that is watching this office. And I bless you that that greater power should continue to watch and bless this office and that whatever you do inside this office and that whatever emanates from this office should be blessed with success. Amen. Before we just put it up, a mezuzah just because it's being recorded is something very important for everybody to understand and, and uh, especially a, a leader of the political world. There's an argument between the commentators and the authorities 
of Middle Eastern descent or the Sephardic descent and the Ashkenazic, the European descent, which way a mezuzah is placed? Is it placed straight up or is it placed sideways? And the Sephardic goes straight out, the Tosafot says it goes sideways. We don't do it that way. We put it on a slant. And the reason is when a person walks into his house or into such an office, he has to know sometimes you can't go straight, sometimes you go sideways. Do it on a slant. Learn to compromise. I'm sure that's the art, the art that Mr. Blake will be doing for the next four years for sure and many, many more years in the, in the future. Okay. You may have you may you, you, you may have to put it on the side because my wife is Sephardic. You know? <laughs> okay. And she always wins. We'll, we'll, no we'll, we'll, do you want to give Sigal the uh, the? Just one, just one moment. With okay. the and this is, by the way, if you can look up, this is the official mezuzah of Nassau County.